Hello guys, Zuljin here. Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Indoors. Today I want to show you a really chic bedroom design using a lot of black and yellow themes. Today I wanted to challenge myself to use some of the banners from the new snapshots and I can tell you they work really really well. I didn't go too deep into design with them just because I wanted to show you that they can be quite flexible as something besides just a banner decor. So I'm using them as light fixtures in here. Now the back of them are kind of exposed, but that's not necessarily a terrible thing. It does give it a little bit different add than just bringing down, let's say metal bars or glass for the light fixture. And I think it worked very well. I also incorporated them, incorporated them in front of these black stained glass panes and used them as kind of like curtains. Now the cool thing about these is they stack. So watch this. If I go ahead and select one, I can use it like this and then I can use it like that and that. So they kind of connect. Now this is the Sortex Fanware pack. I'm not too sure how that translates into something like Fateful or Default, but all in all, they seem to overlap and it makes quite a great curtain. I really, really like that. Ended up using some lamps in the corners. My classic anvil over anvil crossed up with a glowstone block and behind the, well, behind the redstone lamp, I actually have the uh, hidden redstone, but it exposes it, it, it hides it quite well, so it's not exposed and it still looks good. I did a couple of inset shelving with the yellow and then with the yellow, I started thinking what's a good complementary color? So I decided to go with the regular stained clay, uh, the hardened clay as the floor. Now in default, this looks a little bit different. What you'd probably have to do is maybe change this to orange instead of the yellows and go with red sand. And I think the red sand and the hardened red sand blocks would look really, really good to complement that. But today I wanted to go with yellow. I did a small entrance rug just to kind of give the room a variation. And I did a little side table. I incorporated a couple of paintings to not only add light, but just to add a little bit to the walls. I wanted to stay semi-minimalistic. And I did this cool little clock design. Now, the compass actually kind of works better in Sortex Fanvare, but I decided to show the clock just to see what it would look like. And it's not too bad since it's like that yellow and gold tint. Uh, the black is quite seamless in this texture pack. You can probably use coal blocks to emulate the same type of look in vanilla. And for the windows, I also chose the light gray wool that went behind the windows on the outside. So it kind of shows like a mini blind effect or whatever. All in all, it really, really pulls the room together and I was really happy about it. The bed is something simple. I used the yellow stained clay along with a couple of black wool blocks and some black wool carpet. And then I just used the snow layers for the pillows, just with a couple decorations like a plant, a little tree and some paintings here and there along with some bookshelves. All in all, guys, I really like the design and I hope you did too. Thank y'all so much for watching. And as always, this is Uljin signing off. We'll see you next time. Bye.